Hi guys, right, next update. Uh, I have drilled the hole for this USB connector and the uh, cheapest thing I found was this metal hole cutter. Uh, it's five pounds. Uh, I've got Prime Amazon membership, so I got it next day for a fiver. Uh, so that was nice and easy. The hardest hole, it's a rectangle to cut, is this. You can buy a special cutter of the right size. Unfortunately, the cutter is a hundred pounds. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I've gone with the uh, drill a few holes and then just enlarge it with. Uh, with a file and a Dremel. Uh, didn't get it quite square, but uh, you know what the hell? It's uh, it's not on view in the front room or anything. It's just uh, it's just in the workshop. So yeah, that's the uh, that's the tricky one. Uh, that if you buy the right 24 mm uh, hole cutter is uh, nice and easy. So we've done a few other bits. Just going to turn this over. You can see there the uh, positive is the green wire and that leads over onto the lower of the two thermocouple connections here and positive at the uh, top. Also you, well, you can see this rectangle was so tight I had to hammer the connection in so there's really no need to have this little plastic uh, piece that holds it in place. Um, if I'd enlarged it slightly more so it went in and out nice and easily then this would have been required but I've put it there anyway. And uh, the other USB connector is, uh, I just drilled one mil holes, you can just see in there, it's one of the screws and the other one's up here. Uh, kit didn't come with uh, counter sunk screws so I've just found a couple of those drilled one mil holes and just screwed those in that's nice and uh, nice and tight the supplied USB uh, adapter cable is fitted and that goes on to uh, here the uh, FTDI pins there it's got black at that end as you can see and uh, yeah, green is marked on the board at the uh, other green mm, looks like it's yellow to me but uh, <coughs> unless I've changed the colors at some point I'll have to have a look in the wiring diagram but I'm going with it that way because it's definitely says black at that end I'm sure that says GRN but uh, it's definitely uh, greeny yellow, it's yellow as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> you can see the connector to the uh, LEDs, that's clearly shown on the picture in the instructions which way around to put that. The same with the fan connector, and uh, yeah, that's where we are uh, so far. Uh, next stage is to mount the two uh, SSIs on the, uh, the main unit on the back. You're going to be using two of the existing holes and drilling two uh, new holes. And I haven't read the instructions yet, but I suspect they're going to want this uh, secured in place with some uh, hot melt glue so this doesn't vibrate out uh, over the months of, uh, of use. And uh, possibly the same with uh, all of these other connections. Anyway, that was the next update and uh, back in a little while.